Hello, I've had a package arrive today. I've been waiting for this probably about two weeks, I suppose. And it's just arrived and it's a new LED grow light. And I'm going to be replacing this one above my propagation tray. This is the one here that I'm using at the moment, just my propagation tray. And it's jack seeds are still in there and I'm going to be putting up a new light so this one's just a fluorescent tube and it just shines out a bright white light and the new one that I've got is a warm light so I'll show you a picture of it on the screen so this is the box that it's come in it's about 50 to 55 centimeters long the actual light but I'm a bit concerned because the picture on the box doesn't look like the the light that I've ordered so we're going to have to open it up and have a look okay so I've snipped open the ends and I'm going to take it out now Okay, so the picture on the box completely doesn't match the light. So this looks like the one that I actually ordered. So that's a good sign. And it feels really nice, nice and heavy in quality. And these I think are made of aluminium, the aluminium fins. So it helps with the heat dissipation. And you can see the different coloured LED lights there. And it comes with a UK plug, which you select at time of purchase. And I think I might be using these brackets this time round. Well, we'll see. I might use what I've got already hooked up into my cupboard. Okay, so I'm just going to plug it in. Okay, so Jack, turn on the plug for me. Wow, let's have a look. I'm going to the A Hang on, you don't look at the light. Okay, so that's the lights. I'm not looking at it, so I can't tell if this is coming out very clear or not. Not too happy about that soldering work at the end there. Looks a bit weird. Oh, well, very good. So it's, I'll put up what the colours are on the screen for you. So I'm just trying to hold it up here just to give you an idea of the length of it. So it's about a similar length, that's why I wanted this one, so it would fit above here in my kitchen. Okay, so I'm very, very, very happy with the light that it's shining off. And I just want to show you on the end, where the lead comes, that it has this information on the end. has these numbers and the other end and it gives us a really nice light it's a much brighter than my clip-on grow lights that I'm using at the moment and this cost me Eighteen pounds ninety nine pence, and it came from abroad, so I had to wait a little while for it. Okay, so the reason why I want to change my light is because this one is obviously a bright white light. Um, it's fluorescent, and it's more for getting the seeds going and the seedlings um, to um, germinate. 
but all of the the seedlings you can see in here i've only got a few left because i've moved some others now under my other grow lights so all of the ones that you see here don't seem to be growing much more now under this light so what i want to do is bring in a different type of light to now get them to grow properly so what I've been doing lately is I've been unplugging this one and just leaving this here but keeping the the thermostat which is down there um, plugged in to keep the heat there but on warm days I've turned it off and um, these are my seedlings from two years ago and they are now sprouting into life they've got the bright green bits on the top now where they're coming back to life and they're showing signs of growth so I've fertilized, fertilized these with some tomato feed initially because they were starting to look a little bit discolored um, and since I've put them under this strip light here they've now really moved along with their growing I think because they're a bit older they are more suitable for this light whereas these in here are a lot younger and they're being a bit resistant to this bright light so I'm going to change it to a different type of light if that makes any sense so going back to the box it did say when I bought this that it might not come in its original box it could come in just a plastic bag sort of thing but I'm pleased that it did come in a box um, <laughs> It was just a bit concerning because the picture on the front didn't match what was in the box, but um, it could just be a case of recycling packaging, you know. But it's better that it came in a box and it was properly um, kept safe with this soft foam inside. So I'm going to be giving this grow light a try. I hope you like this video. Thank you for watching.